Hey guys, welcome to another edition of The Blind Pastor Plays. Today we're going to be playing some Madden. Yes, my name is Derek. I'm a pastor, a multi-time author, of course a gamer, and I do all this legally blind. But this cross doesn't get me down, and neither should yours. The Lord's Word tells us in 2 Corinthians 12 and 9 that the Lord's strength is made perfect in our weakness. Start conquering whatever issue you're facing in life today. Have God with your back. Let Him know. Let others know that you can conquer anything you face in this life. Remember, His grace is sufficient for us, and His strength is made perfect in our weakness. Start using your weakness to be a strength for God today. That being said, the challenge today is to see if this blind pastor can win at the Pro Bowl as we are the AFC taking on the NFC here in Madden. As always, folks, we're going to talk about a biblical topic today, and our topic is Romans 6 and 23. There God's Word tells us the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life through Jesus Christ our Lord. Yes, in football, the pay dirt is getting to the end zone, the ultimate goal, and our ultimate, our ultimate goal is to get to a life everlasting. But the wages, what's going to keep us from getting there is sin. Are we sinning in our life? Oh, I kicked that out of bounds. Are we sinning in our life today? Is that going to keep us from a heavenly home? Only you and God know. The wages of those sin is eternal death, but the gift is eternal life. If we conquer the sin in this life, if we go hard after it, our pay dirt will be a home in heaven. But we're all after, guys. I thank you so much for being with me today. Let's get after it. Oh, no. Cook is running up the middle. Oh, that was a huge gain. Taking on Aaron Rodgers and the NFC. All-Stars here, and I'm the AFC All-Stars. I'm an AFC guy. I always have been. Get him. Ah, oh, yes. Woohoo! Got this set on three minute quarters. Otherwise, we'd be here for a while. This makes the games tight, exciting. Ah! Oh! Oh, that horrible kick really did me in. Thank you guys for being with me, as I said. This is the place for all things faith and fun while always putting God first with Christ his son. If that sounds like what you've been looking for, you're in the right place, my friends. Remember to hit the subscribe and like buttons on YouTube and follow us on Poetically Christian Gamer Twitch. And you'll know when we're live. Oh! oh. Man! Uh, you the NFC are on the move here, man. Come on, get him. Oh, man. Do a little fake here. Who's you guys' favorite NFL team? Mine's the Denver Broncos. Has been my whole life. Always been a Broncos guy. John Elway, TD Terrell Davis, Shannon Sharp, those were my guys growing up. Those great Broncos teams from the late 90s. <laughs> well, it didn't take long, did it, guys? DeAndre Hopkins with the touchdown grab. Oh, man. The NFC's on the board already, guys. Let's see this again. Got all day. Oh. Look at that. You could count the ways back there. Like the count from Sesame Street. Oh, they're going to check this, guys. Did he get... Oh! Did he get it? Did he get it? Did he get it? Oh, I don't, yeah, it looks like he did. If you're sitting there wondering, how's a blind guy playing games? Well, I have a 
illness called Stargardt's I've had since birth. It affects my central vision, but I'm still able to utilize the peripheral vision the Lord has afforded me to play games, just like this. And in most, I hold my own, but we'll see if that holds up today. <laughs> I have not played any Maddens in a serious minute, but I felt like, you know, football season's kicking off here and uh, it seemed appropriate for this blind pastor to go to the gridiron. Oh, what a fake. All right. So Aaron Rodgers drove the NFC down the field. Let's see if Patrick Mahomes can do the same for the AFC here. Former Texas Tech Red Raider Patrick Mahomes. Well documented that he's the son of a former major league pitcher. But Pat has always right. said that football has fired him up in a way that baseball just didn't. He always wanted to be a football player. Still has the big arm that his father had, and he uses yeah, it to big send Derek. The ball downfield in a big one from one Derek to another. Here's Derek Henry. Oh, the beast. <laughs> Grinding it up in there as big as he is. He could get like a Yard or two on every play. He's a big guy. Oh, that's the end of the first. Yep. We're really going to have to manage the clock here. I forgot about that. I have it set on these short quarters just to, to keep it moving. It will require some clock management, guys. Let's get it. Oh. I overthrew it. Oh, pass interference, yes. Woohoo! We will take it, guys. Oh, come on. Hey, by hooker. What are the old expression by hooker crook? If that wasn't a crook, he was. That was justified. Yes! Oh, that looked like a touchdown. Come on. Oh, that looked like a touchdown, I think. It was just a little short, though. Can we do this, guys? Mahomes! He's in there! Touchdown! Okay. Woohoo! Yeah! Alright, guys. We may not win this, but we're gonna fight. Mahomes! He fights! Fights to get it in there for the touchdown! Alright! Alright! Uh, now kicking for me is a little squirrely. I am not the best kicker in the world. I'm a little squirrely on my kicking. I'll admit it. As you saw on the first drive. Each team's had it. Each team has scored. Seven seven here is the kicks. All right. Away. There, that's a better one. Fielded near the back of the end zone. Yeah, we'll take a touch back over a kick out of bounds. <laughs> that's better, right, guys? Uh, what teams do you think are gonna be dominant in the NFL this year? I'm hoping my Broncos can do pretty good. I think the Raiders, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say that the Las Vegas Raiders are gonna be a dark horse in the AFC. I think the Buffalo Bills are also going to be good. And I'm hoping my Broncos can hold their own. They're in a tough division, let's face it, against Mahomes, Derek Carr. Two-minute warning. We got a tie ball game here, guys. And how lucky are we? We have a chance at heaven. We have a chance at pay dirt to getting to a heavenly home. Thanks to our Savior Jesus Christ. He paid the price on the cross so that the wages of sin can be overcome. 
shotgun now for Rodgers. Oh, it's caught by Adams. That one a first down pickup of eight. Rodgers again now. Get him, yeah! Woohoo! Gonna call the first of their three timeouts. Get some lunch with that sack. With exactly a minute to go before halftime. From midfield, here's Rogers. He'll find Metcalf. Oh no! Bounds, but not before he takes it inside the 40. They get 14 uh -huh. back, but it leads now to a third down. In so many ways, throwing the hitch route is actually one of the safer things. Oh, come on. Get the ball out to the, the nail biter, guys. Hope he's got man to man coverage. Oh. Oh. The gonna take a time out there second as they get the stoppage with just under 50 seconds remaining in half number one from the 32 now here's first uh. and 10. working from the gun Rogers a stoppage or something into the hands of Dalvin cook they'll contain him to just four second down four yards on the pickup Oh, this is a close one, guys. He went backwards. He'll be down at the 30. It'll go down as a two-yard loss, and it brings up a third down. Now a timeout. Brings up third seven seconds. So they've, eat up, they've eaten up all their uh, timeouts, so. Here we go, guys. They're going to settle for a field goal here. That's it. He got it. It's a fan of good. Right then the pay. All right, guys. The tough challenge I have this set on... Is it Madden difficulty? Or Pro? I can't remember which one it is. One of the two. <laughs> I can't remember what I said on. But uh, here we go. Gonna get the ball to start the second half. Thanks very much, and welcome everyone to this abridged version of the EA Sports Halftime Report. We got an excellent first half from the former MVP, Mr. Aaron Rodgers. His guys lead, though by only a field goal, still anybody's game. As we send it back to Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. Thank you, sir. A field goal separation. All right, here we go. As we come back for this second half. Now this will make it into the end zone. Oh, look at the jukes. No oh, look at the jukes. They'll get him down at about the 17 yard line. Uh, no good, though. I should have just taken that one in there. Uh, the taking that one in the end zone. All right, here we go. Now it's the offense's turn as they've got it first and ten. Oh, he gets buried in the backfield. Two yards, the loss, second and twelve. This defense is just flat getting after it. They have not given up much of anything in the run game. Case in point, right there. Well, the opening play of the drive goes backwards. Now they'll come up on second and twelve. Again, it's Henry. Oh. I can't do anything. This is horrible. Yeah, really. Let it go. Oh. But appears they're going to come up empty on this first drive of the second half, still down by that slim margin. Yeah, and that's okay. You know, when, when you sit and analyze it, they're not happy about what happened, having to go to the bench. But this gives them a chance to let their defense do some work while they on the sidelines go over what they're doing offensively and formulate a proper plan. Oh, this is horrible, guys. What in the world did I, I pick the fake? Oh, I didn't realize I picked a fake. Oh, that's horrible. <laughs> oh, I had just cost myself my this challenge. This is oh my goodness. I didn't realize I picked a fake. Oh my goodness, that's horrible. 
Oh, that's terrible, guys. Oh, I may have just lost this. Oh, I didn't realize I. Oh, I thought I picked a punt. Oh, man. Oh, I may have just uh, cost myself big time. Oh, this is horrible. He's got it! Go! 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 <laughs> well, there's one of them back. Oh, man. Oh. Oh, man. Look at this. This is a beauty. Oh. Oh, that was pretty. That was pretty. Alright. Oh, well, I may not win this thing, but at least we'll uh, we'll make it a game, right, guys? Oh, I cost myself. I can't believe it. I can't believe that I did that. That's just it's awful. Oh, I just cost myself the game right there, guys. How in the world? This is awful, guys. Oh. Get him! Intercepted! Yes! Yes! Oh! Yes! <laughs> oh, man! The game changer from the depths of despair. Oh, man. Just like the wages of sin, we were all under sin. And thanks to Christ, we all have a chance now at eternal life. From the depths of despair, from the wages of sin, we have a chance at eternal life. And from the wages of losing this game, we got a chance! We got a chance! Woohoo! To win this thing! Oh, oh man. And that's the big fellas MO right there. Running through tackles, keeping the sticks moving forward. This defense, if you don't bring 11 guys to the ball to try and get him on the ground, he's going to keep making runs like that. I feel the press box shaking. Oh, gosh. Every time he touches the rock. Going deep for Diggs. Oh, that was close. But you got to think that sooner or later, they're going to hit one of those. But the coverage has been excellent thus far. And it wasn't. That was close, guys. Woo -wee. This one has been fun so far as the Pro Bowl usually is. A lot of relaxed faces out there. Second and ten. Get it. Oh. Third 
An important play right here, third and ten. <sighs> and I would expect pressure here. They're going deep for Hill. This is caught inside. He's the got team. it. And He's got it. Out of bounds just inside the ten. <sighs> They're able to convert on third down, and that sets up a first and goal. Oh my goodness, guys! Look at this. <laughs> Oh, this is crazy. This is crazy, guys. Looks like a jumbo what do you think? That's the end of the third. What do you think of this game, guys? Come on. You got to root me on. Two out of that run, and it's going to bring up a second and goal. Defensively, pretty good start there with their backs against the wall. That's a win for the stop troops right there. And if I'm them, I get a little bolder now. They won the first battle. Keep coming out. Oh, they got me. Oh. Uh. on that field but this is a big play third and goal this will be caught right around the six and he's going to be brought down just shy of the five at the six ten yards gets him closer but now it's fourth and goal fourth down and goal three points separating these two sides with two minutes left to go in the fourth I'm going to go for it guys So I'm going for it. As we welcome you back, likely the play of the game here, trailing in the final quarter, and, and that is caught for an AFC yes! touchdown. Yes! Yes! Oh! Oh man! We went for it, and we got it. Woohoo! Retaken the lead. Oh! Touchdown and congratulations! Oh man! Relaxation ahead of them, right? Woo! This is a nail biter. <laughs> This is crazy. Right. Yes, you have to get those guys ready, and you also have to talk to your special teams oh, yeah. guys. Make sure the kickoff is exactly what uh. you want and cover it well. Still an important piece of business to take care of. The extra point. Uh. And it's no I missed it. Oh no! <laughs> I can't believe it! I hooked it! Oh no, that may cost me, guys. Oh, that may cost me. <laughs> oh. Down 20 to 17, a minute 56 to go. How will this thing pan out? We'll watch as they come up on first down. Now a throw over the middle, and he's got it to start the drive. And he's going to be dropped following a pickup of seven, past the 30 to the 32. Middle of the field to Jefferson. Justin Jefferson. Oh, man. He's back to throw. This went into the hands of Metcalf. And he is out of bounds inside the 35. That's what they need right now. Get the first down, get out of bounds, stop the clock. Just playing smart football. Oh, this is awful. The situation, making the plays necessary and making sure that clock stops at every opportunity. And again, it's Rodgers. That'll be complete to Cook. Not much there, only a yard. That's now four completions in a row. A good bounce back following the interception last drive. Certainly not letting it affect him, that's for sure. And we all know interceptions oh, are going to happen. I'm sorry. So uh, this is a nail biter, guys. What's going to happen? The intended target, TJ Hawkinson. But now it'll be third. I'm trying to stop him. To throw is stop him. Still well short of what he needed. Three yards 
Ryan's all they could muster there, and it'll bring up fourth down. Now I'm gonna call a timeout. They're gonna try to eat a lot of that clock. It's just their first. They've got two more to use here in the final stages. Certainly Make sure they leave me some time here. This to tie things up in the final minute. And this will split the uprights. It's right down the middle. And that will tie this game here in the final minute of the play. We knew this had to be a tight game, but with less than three minutes to play. That was awful. I can't believe if I'd have made that. Let's go back. Take it on the 25. Huh. Yeah, pretty Oh, a little dribbler. Why did I do that? Which means someone will have a play made against them and not have to live with that for the rest of the year. Second and six, just inside the 30. Oh, timeout. I don't know why I went for a run there. Here defensively, they go play fake. Mahomes, the right side going to be caught. Oh. And this will not get close to the first down marker as he's brought down at the 26. Oh, we got to go to overtime. Oh, I can't believe this. Oh. If only I'd have made that extra point, right? Right? <laughs> oh, hey, win, lose, or draw, man, we've had fun. I thank you guys for being with me. GG, good game, and God is good. He truly is. We get the ball to start this thing. Come on, guys, we need a touchdown. Oh. Unit getting set to take over. They control their own destiny here. They have the football in overtime. Obviously, a touchdown would win it. And I think teams around the league are still <sighs> adjusting to the idea of going downfield, scoring a touchdown wins the game because they were used to just going downfield and trying to get, in get it range to win a game. Still oh. to make that transition. Let's face it now. The ones who are doing it best know they need to go down, attack, put the ball in the end zone, and not leave it up to a field goal and give the other team a chance. As we said, they control their own destiny now. After the incompletion, here's second and ten from the 20. They fake the give. Now Mahomes going deep for Diggs. Get it. And that'll be incomplete oh. as it's knocked away. But a penalty flag is down. So who's this gonna yes, be yes, pass interference, <laughs> yes, so yes. Before the ball arrived, penalty flag for pass interference. And trying to avoid uh. pass interference is so difficult. You're trying to slow down these skilled receivers, and somehow, some way, they make plays on the football, and sometimes you're there too soon. So how about oh, that man. for a chain mover? They're all the way down inside the 40 now for first and 10. Going deep for Diggs. And the throw left sideline here is caught. Uh, they're really incomplete. Oh, they're saying he's out. Oh, come on. Just connected on the previous shot. They run another set for him on the next play. Now we have a guy who made the catch. They're trying to get the big one downfield, but came up. Oh, and this will go as a gain of seven as he gets it to the 30 yard line. They get seven out of that, so they're left with a third and three. Ah, that's tough to play zone defense when they can just curl up right there in front of you. Yeah, absolutely. Well, we, we talk about finding the soft spot defensively. How do you make sure they don't find the soft spot like they did there? Yes! 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 <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh! In one of the craziest games ever that you'll see. Oh my goodness. 
I can't believe that just happened. Oh, they're stunned in silence. Oh, man. What a game. What a game, guys. So, Charles, final thoughts on this AFC Woo! Oh, thank you so much for being with me, guys. I love you all. This is a place for faith and fun while we always put God first. With Christ, his son, we thank you for being with us. I love each and every one of you. If you enjoy this kind of thing, remember to hit the like, the subscribe button over on YouTube, and also remember to hit the follow on Poetically Christian Gamer Twitch, and you'll know when we're live. Oh, this was a crazy game. Oh, the wages of sin, guys, as we talked about, is death. It's our eternal death. If we continue to live a life of sin, follow sin, it's not going to lead anywhere. But if we choose a life of godliness, an eternal home in heaven is waiting for us. Thank you for joining us. GG, guys. Good game, and God is good. Till the next one, blessed wishes.